Good morning, everyone. Today we are going to learn mail merge using MS Word. So basically, what is mail merge? Mail merge is something when we send to number of participant a common matter, right? When we need to submit some common details to number of recipient is called mail merge. For example, that can be a document or that can be a mail. For example, uh, your joining letter that can be shared to number of people. Content will be same, but recipient will be different. So in this video, we are going to learn how to perform mail merge on MS Word. So step number one, for this activity, we need to access mailing tab. After that, go to start mail merge. Here are options on which we can apply mail merge. Letters, email, envelope, label, directory, normal word document. But in this activity, we need to apply this knowledge on last option, step-by-step -step, mail merge wizard. After clicking the option start mail merge, Step by step, right side you have a pane in which you need to follow step one, two, six. So according to this window, first step is starting document. Select your document category. You want to write letter, mail, envelope, label or directory. So as it is a, our first initiative, so we'll take letters. Second question. Do you want to set up your letters? Then further we have three categories. Do you want to use current document? Do you have template or any existing document? We don't have any template. We don't have any existing document. So we'll go with option current document. Step three, use an existing list. Use an existing list. Do you have an existing list of for your recipients? No. Do you have Outlook contacts? No. Type a new list. If you are doing this activity first time, then you will type your list now. Go to option create. And here you need to fill database. Then do the next entry. Thank you. 
So we need, uh, we have created here one kind of database. Click on OK. Those entries has been uh, created with your uh, file dbl, latest db. That database has been linked to your current file. Now next step is write your letter. Now we need to type our letter. For example, you are going to write your uh, joining letter. So we'll write here. Some details, enter. So subject, then here we, uh, Dear, after dear, we'll write some contact. We are pleased to inform, please to inform you that that you have been. Selected for selected as an intern in. Okay, so here is some material that we want to write in our letter. So next step is this letter should be linked with your database entries. So go to again mailing tab. Here is insert merge field that you need to connect with this file. So here we will write company name. We are pleased to inform you that you have been selected in as an intern in this particular company name. Here will be name of the person, first name, subject we need to write, joining letter in here is again your company name that should be coming from your database automatically. And before this, there are some details about person like title, then space, first name, then space, last name, enter address. Then state, fine. So we have written some material for our letter, right? In And linked with database entries. Next step is checking your output. In this uh, file, I have written title two times. Please remove that. Okay. Now, next step, preview your letter. You can see this, these things. Mr. Manpreet Singh, Lakshmi Nagar, Delhi. Joining letter in LNT. Dear Manpreet, we are pleased to inform you that you have been selected as an intern in LNT. So all the de these details are coming from your database. And similarly, you can check for second entry from here and here too. Miss Anjali Sharma Noida Dupi uh, joining letter in Infosys. And we are pleased to inform you that you have been selected as intern. So in this way, your merge will be completed. Thank you all.